Good evening. Hoy sí ya puedo. Hello, good evening, everyone. <laughs> How are you, people? How are you tonight? Good, and you? Everybody good? I'm good, thank you. Happy because it's Friday. <laughs> are you happy because it's Friday, everyone? Hello. Hello? Hello, hello. Everybody's nice tonight. Es me. Yes, <laughs> it's Friday, you say. <laughs> Welcome, Nevi, Maria Emilia. We have Kenya, Vanessa, Gabriela. Welcome. And we have Santa Guadalupe, Judy, Blanca, Sochil. Welcome. We have only girls today. Only girls today. We don't have boys today. We don't have boys tonight. What happened with the man tonight? <laughs> what happened with the boys, with the man tonight? <laughs> son niñas mis, son niñas. <laughs> Only girls tonight, okay. So it's girls' night. <laughs> We're going to make a pajamas party. <laughs> okay. Don't you have plans for your weekend? No plans. Working. Working. Are you going to work on the weekend? Yes. 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 Everybody's working. The two days, Saturday and Sunday, you working? Today. The two days. Okay. My goodness. You are very hard working. Yes. So yes. those are the plans. So nobody's going to go to the beach. No plans to go to the beach. To Surf City. Yes. No? Hey, Judy. Are you going to go to the beach? Voy Judy. <laughs> Judy. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm sorry, Judy. No le escuchamos. Hasta, hasta el domingo, le dije. Ah, on Sunday, where? To El Mahahual, San Diego, Costa del Sol, where? Al lado de Los Cóbanos. A Los Cóbanos. Sí. Ah, that is good. Well, that's good. Somebody else is going to the beach. ¿Quién va para la playa? Or going to El Cerro Verde, for example, to a forest, to the park, where? No plants? No. No? No, by the moment. <laughs> okay. You know, sometimes the plants are cleaning the house, right? Cleaning the house. <laughs> Yo me voy para la maca de mi casa. Your guy. Oh, <laughs> okay, but, but it's very good because you're relaxing, right? Yes, you swing. And you can sleep also in the hammock. So that's cool also. That's a good plan. <laughs> Okay, let's continue then. Remember that yesterday we were with the present continuous and we were with the falling intonation, we were with the rising intonation and we did also some of the answers with the WH questions. So we have other questions here which we are going to answer. It says form of present continuous tense, WH question. Let's answer. We have, what am I doing now? How will you answer this? Judy, possible answer? Possible answer to this question? What am I doing now? I am um, mm -hmm. in class. Mm -hmm. But what activity? You need to respond in present progressive. Okay, I am studying, I am learning, or I am listening to the class also, right? It's I am listening, listening to the class. That's very good, listening to the class. Is Se it? escucha, Miss. Yes, I can. Solo se le escucha como lejano. Es que right? tengo problemas con, los, con el micrófono. With the, ah, maybe the microphone. Sí. Y si me coloco los otros, igual se me, se me corta, así que creo que mm, aquí no, se pero escucha. Sí se escucha. Se voy, escucha. A gritar, voy a gritar. Ok, shout, shout. <laughs> that is good. So um, I am listening to the class. That's great. Look, remember that this one in the case of a question about me, right, about I, it depends on who you're asking. Depende de quién va dirigida la pregunta, porque yo me puedo preguntar a mí mismo, right, ¿qué estoy haciendo? Alguien más también puede responder. 
So if you formulate the question to another person, what's the possibility? You are listening to the class. Ah, very good job. That's nice. You are listening to the class. All it depends who you ask to. Todo depende de quién va dirigida la pregunta, right? So that's you. You are listening to the class. Very good. Okay, let's see the next one. Who are you playing football with? Who are we playing football with? Or who are they playing football with? Let's suppose that the question it goes directed to they. Maybe. Answer. Who are they playing football with? Not. Are who? not. Who? 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 Investigate. Who? Remember, investigate like the person, a specific person. ¿Con quién? ¿Con quién ellos están jugando fútbol? Who are they playing football with? ¿Con quién? Sí, perdón. Ajá. Eh, sería la respuesta, quiero ver. The subject is they, right? Who are they playing football are they, with? You, are they playing football with? ¿Qué es with, Miss? Con, con. 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 They playing football they with? They are, remember the verb, you did it. They are, you need to go. They you. are. Ah, that's good. Playing uh -huh. football with. Football with. So you my need to son. mention person, right? Uh -huh. Yes. My son. Excellent. That's correct. With my son. That's good. Yes. That's a good answer. Nice one. That's cool. They are, right? Is missing. Are. Are playing football with my son. That's all right. Good one. What about the next one? Where is he going? Where is she going? Or where is it going? So you need to mention a place. Maria Emilia, give us an answer, please. Where is... Eh, voy a formular la pregunta, o... No, the answer. Give us the answer. Where is... Let's suppose that is he. Supongamos que es eh, él. Where is he going? That's my subject, he. Is he, is he? He is. He is. Uh -huh. Now the action. Uh, what is going, the action? Very good. Going. He's going. Um, going. He's going. You need yeah, to, okay. right? Going to, porque está yendo a, siempre que utilizamos un ah. verbo que nos dirijamos o nos desplacemos de un lugar a otro, necesitamos el to. Igual con el verbo come, porque es voy a un lugar, no voy parque, ¿verdad? Go, the park, go, school, go, work. You say go to the office, go to my house. Same here, hay desplazamiento. Entonces, going to, and now mention a place. Supermarket. Ah, okay, that's good. Going to the supermarket. Play football. And just that, no action. No action, because the principal action is going. Pero podemos mencionar the... el área donde se juega fútbol. You can say to the stadium, to o the que... field. Uh -huh. Vaya, que como un going ya es la acción, tenemos Ajá. que buscar específico. Ajá. I go to my house. Exactly. A casa. Ajá, correct. Porque como investigamos, ¿a dónde está yendo? Uh, I'm going to uh, the park. I'm going to the restaurant. I am going to the stadium. I am going to my work. I am going to Merliot. I am going to Aguachapán. I am going to Chalatenango. Places. Siempre que sea going, vamos a ponerle Digamos como el lugar específico para donde vamos. Ajá. Going to. Porque este van, van a ir unidos. Porque hay desplazamiento. Okay. Going to. Where are you going? ¿A dónde vas? 
It's like what mothers write, como cuando las mamás nos preguntan, ¿y para dónde vas? Where are you going? You don't have permission. <laughs> <laughs> so you need to formulate like that, right? He's going to the supermarket. Now, let's read them. Let's check them here. Let's start. Gabriela, I am listening to the class. I am listening to the class. Good. You are listening to the class. You are listening to the class. That's good. Continue. Adali says, they are playing football with my son. Ada? Hello, hello. Are you there? <laughs> okay. Repeat. Yes. They are playing football with my son. They are playing football with my son. That's good. Thank you. Let's continue. Rafael. He's going to the supermarket. Rafael, are you present? Aaron? I are present. You present. Hello, hello. Okay, Rafael. <laughs> hello, welcome. He's going okay. to the supermarket. Rafael? Hola. Hello. Acá, acá. Yes? Ando con su cabrando en la calle aún. Ah, okay. Okay, so you can know. Okay. All right. Can you listen? Se escucha. No? All right, Aaron, sí, sí, sí. Can you? Hello, yes. teacher. Buenas noches. Hey, hey, good evening. Welcome to the class. Sorry. It's okay. Can Tengo you listen? He tenido, he tenido problemas okay. con la computadora. No sé qué me pasa, pero no me conecta. Ah, you have problems. Okay. Pero, okay. But now? Eh, un, un, un refresh, por mm -hmm. favor, porque no. Ah, we are reading. We are reading here. With the present progressive, we have answers. And I need you to repeat this one. He's going to the supermarket. Repeat. He's going to the supermarket. Okay. That's correct. He's going... Yes. Okay. Yes. Continue, Rafael. He's going to the supermarket. That's correct. Yes. Thank you. Okay. We have these examples of answers. Now we are going to watch our video on the platform. Hi everyone. In this class you'll learn to No problem? No problem. No? Okay, perfect. Thank you. Ask and answer present continuous questions. Additionally, we will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation between a boy and his mother, which illustrates WH questions in context. Let's listen and practice. Hi, Mom. What are you doing, Steve? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Now, let's try to make sense of present continuous WH questions. We will typically use present continuous WH questions whenever we want to get information from an action that is in progress. For example, what are you doing right now? To form WH questions, we need to follow this formula. WH word plus verb to be plus subject plus the verb plus ing plus some kind of complement. If we look at the images on the screen, you can see a few WH questions. Let's analyze the first one. What's Victoria doing? 
we have a WH word, what? Then we have the verb to be, is. After that, we have the subject, Victoria. After that, we have the uh, verb in its ing form. And then we have a question mark. Then, of course, you can see the question being answered. She's sleeping now. Now, we're going to listen to the rest of the questions and answers. Let's listen and repeat. Los Angeles, 4 a.m. What's Victoria doing? She's sleeping right now. Mexico City, 6 a.m. What's Marcos doing? It's 6 a.m., so he's getting up. New York City, 7 a.m. What are Sue and Tom doing? They're having breakfast. Brasilia, 9 a.m. What's Celia doing? She's going to work. London, 12 noon. What are James and Anne doing? It's noon, so they're having lunch. Moscow, 3 p.m. What's Andre doing? He's working. Bangkok, 7 p.m. What's Permsak doing? He's eating dinner right now. Tokyo, 9 p.m. What's Hiroshi doing? He's watching television. Your city. What are you doing? It's. So I'm. The last thing that I would like for you to do is to look at the images again and write questions and answers about them. For example, what's Celia wearing? Celia's wearing a red suit. After you complete this assignment, please share your work in our discussion forums. Sorry, I'm sorry. Thank you so much. Now we watch the video there. Now we can formulate there other questions. But I have here some examples. In the case that you have, imagine that this one is my family. So we say, who is having dinner? My family is having dinner. So you're talking about the specific persons here. Now let's check here, another picture. Who is reading? My sister is reading. Mm -hmm. In the case that here, that we have a specific name, what is the subject? She. 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 Ah, that's good, it can be she or, or the name, the specific name. Mercedes is uh, reading. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, Mercedes is reading. This is in the case that you investigate the subject when investigamos el sujeto, right? Que re está realizando la acción. So if you have, who is having dinner? My family is having dinner. Who is reading? Mercedes is reading. Now let's repeat it. Judy, let's repeat the first one, please. We have, who is having dinner? We cannot listen. We don't listen. <laughs> yes, we cannot listen. No se le, ahorita sí no se le escucha. Yes. Okay. Sandra Margarita, who is having dinner? Repeat it, please. My family is having dinner. That's good one. Blanca, the next one. Who is reading? Blanca, are you present? No? Sochil? Yes. Mercedes? Uh -huh. 
Mercedes is? Is, is reading. Is reading. Aha, that is correct. Good one. Now let's go ahead on next ones. We have other pictures. What about Jacob? We are going, you're going to answer them in different manners. You give me different actions here. We have the first question. What are Danny and Sue doing? So now we have a plural subject. What they are Danny? Are, Excellent. They, they are. are. Are, they are watching the mountain. Mm, that's good. They're watching the mountain. What else? They are going to the river. Oh, that's good. That's another option. They are going to the river. What else? If they are not in the same country, they can also be. They are traveling, they, right? Uh, tra they are going to travel. They are traveling. They are traveling. All right. Like in general, they are traveling. That's good. What about where is Jacob sleeping? Fernando, possible answer. Where is Jacob sleeping? Fernando, are you present? Me? Yes. Tell me. He's on the room. Ah, uh -uh, in the bedroom? In the action? What is the action? Dormir. Dormir. Uh -huh, Dormir. Sleeping, right? Okay. He. So it's he or she? He. 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 Uh -huh. What he. else? He is. He is. Excellent. Sleeping. Action? Sleeping. In the, sleeping in the... Uh, in the bedroom. Yeah, that's the... right. Very good. No. Yes. <laughs> in the bed? Oh. Uh -huh. It can be in the bed. It can be in the bedroom. In the bed the is bed like, would be like the specific object, right? In the bed. But if you say in the bedroom, that will be the area. Because it can be also uh, in the garden. It can be in the living room. So that will be the specific area. The place. Where is Jacob sleeping? Santa Guadalupe, let's repeat yes. them, please. Una consulta, Miss. Antes yes. de, de pasar Tell me. Cosas. Tell me this. Eh, usted menciona bedroom. 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 Mm -hmm. Ajá. Mm -hmm. Y solamente sería, si yo menciono solamente room. Es correct, solo que no estamos haciendo en específico como room significa en sí espacio. Todo. Mm, Ajá, es bien. un espacio nada más. Pero si yo quiero decir que es la sala, por ejemplo, ya lleva living room. Ajá, okay, correct. Okay. You say living room, like mm. here. Let me show you here. If you talk about the difficult rooms, o sea, what types room of rooms? Es como, rooms es como un cuarto. Es un espacio. Un espacio. Ajá, es pero un espacio ya, en general. Yo lo delimito, this room o... Bedroom. Ajá. Uh -huh. It's a specific. La, uh -huh. To ya sleep. Right? En el espacio eh, donde se duerme. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes, tell Puro me. interrogante. Sería siempre in o in the bedroom. In the bedroom. In the bedroom if it's the area. Si es el área. Mm, todo el si área. está dentro. Todo el ah. área. Todo el área del dormitorio. Right? So it's the bedroom. Okay. So it's el, el espacio donde están las camas. That's why it's bedroom. What about living room? What's a living room? El comedor. Sala. No. La, sala. la sala. La sala. Where you find the o TV. Si no the, yes, now. Yes, Judy. Ah, Welcome okay. back. Welcome. Welcome to the jungle. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so we have the bedroom. We have the living room. What else? What else we have? We have the restroom also. Look, we have a restroom. We have also a bathroom. Very important. Yes. <laughs> we have the bathroom. <laughs> yeah. So, what is um? What is bedroom? Is where Jacob is, right? Is the Dormitorio. area? 
Excellent. Good. What is a living room? La sala. Sala. Uh -huh. Where you watch TV, you have the sofa. Yes, what do you have? Restroom. What's a restroom? Baño. Uh -huh. And bathroom? Baño. Uh -huh. What is the difference? El bathroom es el sanitario. ¿Dónde está el sanitario? Y el restroom es la ducha. It's the contrary, my dear. It's the contrary. El restroom es como eh, la ducha y el otro es el baño. Is that the contrary? Is that the contrary? <laughs> bathroom <laughs> es para necesidades. Ajá. Uh -huh. Where you find the bathroom. toilet. Es que el restroom es donde está pues el inodoro, right? Una, el cuarto de baño, el cuarto eh, de aseo. Uh, ajá, donde está el inodoro, right? But the bathroom, por eso es que acá es una palabra compuesta, porque bath es donde uno toma un baño. Yes? That is the space. Pero restroom es casi como lo, encontra lo que encontramos en el centro comercial. That is a restroom. Y solo uno va y tú, may pisa, may poop in the necessities. Only that. But you don't take a shower. No se toma una ducha en esos lugares. But the bathroom and the ones we have in our house, yes. El que tenemos en casa, sí, right? Because we have o sea, a bathroom. ¿Qué sería el baño público? The Entonces, restroom. Ajá. The restroom. Ajá. Entonces yeah. de decimos bathroom en casa. At home, correct, yes. Sí, Because también. it's like the complete area. Right? Porque hay una ducha. Y, y cuando andamos, en, digamos, afuera, en el súper, decimos... Quiero ir al restroom. Ajá. Ajá. I need to go to the restroom. Uh -huh. Necesito ir a los baños. Porque sabe que ahí no hay duchas. Pero, por ejemplo, hay en algunos lugares como algunos gimnasios en que sí hay un bathroom. Porque sí hay duchas. Uh -huh. So, all it depends. Todo depende si el espacio Teacher. tiene ese. Yes. Teacher. Este, pero, digamos, pues, en, en los colegios cuando a uno le enseñan para ir al baño, uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Then I go to the That's in a general. Eso es como una ah. generalidad. Pero en sí no, no. es correcto porque no hay duchas. Si Entonces solo están sería los... no, restroom. Is, is may restroom. I restroom. Ajá. Ajá. May I go to the restroom? Porque no hay ducha. Ahora hay lugares en los que sí hay ducha, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, hay colegios en los que sí hay una ducha y también el, está el inodoro. So it's complete. Porque se me complicaba el inglés, mis Ay, mi maestro no, decía guay, que so tenía complicado. que decirlo en inglés y yo con la canas y no se decía así. En YouTube Peace. Uh -huh. uno y le dio tu Peace. En inglés, please, me decía. Say yo. it in English. You thought you cannot go to the <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> Espero al receso. Can I go to the restaurant? Can I go to the restroom? Now, to the bathroom is because you take a bath, toma un baño, ah. una ducha, right? Because it's complete, like in your house. Yes, so that's the difference. So room, room is solo un espacio. All it depends what is the specific space, right? Bedroom, living room, restroom, bathroom. Yes? Yes, okay. Let's go ahead then with the next part. Remember that in the platform, you also have an exercise about this. So let's formulate more questions as more examples. For example, if you ask, what's Marcos wearing? As you can see, Marcos, who is in Mexico City, Marcos is wearing pajamas or he's wearing pajamas. Now let's ask other questions like with the time. For example, if I ask, what time is it in Los Angeles? It's 4 a.m. Okay, it's very from... good. It's 4 a.m. Or what is another possibility? 4 o'clock. Love in the morning. Excellent. That's good. What time is it in Los Angeles? So we got two possibilities. It's four o'clock in the morning. In the morning. 
Or what's the other one you said? It's, it's 4 a.m., right? It's a.m. 4 a.m. A.m. ¿Por qué ese what's Marcos quitting va contractado? Oh, because what? you can you can make a contraction and this one will be what is. What is. También podemos contractarlos con la WH, pero no aplica con todos. Si terminan, por ejemplo, con la WH, which, no, that is not correct to make a contraction. Just, incluso suena hasta raro, like, which, no. But you can say, where's, where's, which is, now, this one needs to be complete. Ahora en esta, tiene que ir completo, which is. Si hay palabras que terminan con una CH, entonces es incorrecto hacer una contracción con el verb to be. You say complete, se dice completa. Which is. Pero si termina en W, como go. Like. Go. Si termina en W. But, for example. Uh, oh. House. House. Ah, you mean the W-H. Yeah. House. It's like this. Uh -huh. Oh, you mean sí. who? You mean who? Like this? Sí. No, that sí. one is correct. Pero esta de acá termina con una O. So you say, who's, como termina no con vocal, no hay contactar. problema, ajá, correcto, acá porque termina con what, what's, es correcto, it's house, it's like when you ask, how's your family, cómo está tu familia, how's your family, how's your family, who's, oh, so you can ask, who's um, going, Yeah. Like this. Who's going to the store? ¿Quién va para la tienda? ¿Quién está yendo a la tienda? Who's going to the store? It's a contraction. Or you can say, who is going to the store? So, two words, no sé. may one. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál sería la respuesta? Ah, okay. For ah. example, if you say, right, who's going to the store? Imagine that... Eh, María Emilia, por ejemplo. María Emilia. ¿Qué más? Complete, Going. complete. ¿En the verb? Going to a store. ¿En the verb? Going. Uh, Going. Is. Go. Is. 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 Ah, is. Ah, that's is. good. Is going. Is going to the store. Excellent. That's all right. You say, María Emilia is going to the store. So you have this si queremos decir, si queremos decir, eh, ir, voy a ir a la tienda a comprar un churro. That is future. <laughs> Ese ya sería futuro. That is going to be like. Um, eh, no, going... la respuesta sí, en ese caso sería, who, who is who's going to the store? Sería, mm -hmm. I'm going. If the answer is with I. Se investigó quién, quién es, está yendo a la tienda o quién va para la tienda porque en el momento se está desplazando. Puede decir que yo. Pero si, decimos, si digo yo, o sea. Ah, then I say going. I'm. I'm going. Ajá. I'm going. Solo le cambiamos el sujeto. Like, I'm going to the store. Um, the store. Comprar ¿Cómo? este este shopping, ¿verdad? Ajá, correct. Ajá. I'm going to the store for, for... chips, for example. Chips y de churritos, golosinas. Estoy yendo a la tienda uh, por golosinas, churritos. Mm -hmm. okay. so you can use that one. I'm going, right? You use this one. Like this. So you have different manners to answer here. Now, in the platform, you also have these forms. They ask you about the time. They ask you about the action that they are doing. Questions about this? Oh, y, no. y, y ahí no especificas y ahí no especifica exactamente si puede ser en la mañana o en la tarde pero cómo cómo saber cómo saber eh, se, o, va, o va a depender según lo que estemos leyendo o lo que yeah. estemos haciendo ajá uh, it depends on that because for example what time 
preguntar what time en present progressive no es muy eh, lógico para decir a qué hora está yendo a la tienda. Right? Si ya sabemos qué hora es, right? So you Ajá. can investigate like yes, en or, ese momento. You can say at this moment, correct? So you can ask where are you going? ¿A dónde está yendo? Or for example about Celia. Where is Celia going? At this moment, you can include at this moment. En lugar de decir la hora, puede eh, agregarle en este momento. Or right now, you can say, where is Celia going at this moment? What will be a possibility? Look at Celia. Okay. Yes, at the bank, right? Aha, uh -huh. she's going? To the bank. To the bank. To the bank. Uh -huh. That's correct. So what time is it in Brasilia? It's nine o'clock a.m. or it's nine o'clock in in the morning. The in morning. the morning. In the morning. Uh -huh. That is correct. Now we have also here James and Annie, and they are in London. What are they doing? What are James and Anne doing? They are. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Reading. Having lunch. Have a lunch. Having lunch, right? Okay. Having. It's possible that they're having lunch, but I think they are drinking. Uh huh. Good because it's noon. It's a mediodía. It's noon, so it's lunch. They're having lunch. Now, what about if we ask why? Why is Victoria sleeping? That's another question, right? Why is Victoria sleeping? What would be a, a reason? She is, uh -huh. is, she is sleeping. Good. Or she is? Right now. Or but why? Why? You need to give the reason. Por qué? Sleeping. Uh -huh. uh, How do you say por qué? As an answer. Because. Excellent. That's good. Because. She's sleeping because. What would be a good reason? She's tired. Ah, that's good. That's a good reason. Because she is tired. Está cansada. Because she's tired. Because yeah, she's exhausted. Right? Or because it is very early. Porque es muy temprano. Look, that is 4 a.m. So it's very early. Or because she is tired. So you have all of these possibilities, right? Like to answer, to give a reason. If you investigate the person who is doing certain action, you can formulate the questions about the time. Teacher. Yes, tell me. Y el, y el término madrugada, ¿en, ¿en qué opción entraría? Porque, por ejemplo, las cuatro, de la, las cuatro eh, o'clock allá, allá, es todavía en la madrugada. Mm -hmm. Entra como in the morning. It's at the beginning of the morning, but more specific is like in the down. En la madrugada. In the down. Ajá, so porque de, la, de las cero horas, de la medianoche. Until three or las... four, right? Or even, yes, at four is in the down. Cinco, cinco, seis de la mañana todavía se puede usar madrugada. Is, is down, correct. So it's more specific. Es como más específico. You can say in Ajá. the down. Mm -hmm. So it's in the down. So it's como para in especificar. The down. In the down. Okay. You Thank can you. use it like that. You're welcome. We are going to uh, pass the attendance list. Just let me know if you are present, please. Hoy se ha dado problemas el sistema, teacher. Yes, right. Me Porque me ha sacado varias veces de la, de la plataforma. The platform. He estado fallando quizás el internet, ¿verdad? También. A veces no se escucha bien. 
Okay. All right, let's start. Well, Aaron, you are there. You say present. Present teacher. Thank you, Ada Lisette. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Cada vez, que, cada vez que pasa la lista, no me acuerdo de Nelly. I am here. Ah, ok. You need to say I'm here, ok. <laughs> Alejandra Margarita. <laughs> Alejandra Margarita. No present. Ariel Alexandra. Ariel. Blanca Rosa. Present, dice Blanca Rosa. Ah, present, dice. Thank you so much. Brian René. Brian, present me. Thank you so much. Present. Thank you. Douglas Heriberto. Douglas. Douglas Lopez. No. Elmer de Nilsson. Present. Thank you so much. Fernando de Jesus. Present teacher. Thank you very good. Gabriela Abigail. Present. Thank you so much. Jocelyn Susana. Jocelyn, Fabián, no, Juan Alberto, Juan Alberto, no, Kenia Vanessa, present me, thank you so much, María Emilia, present me, thank you, very good, Marisol Elizabeth, present, thank you, Nevi Solina, I'm here, Miss. Thank you very much. <laughs> Rafael Antonio. Rafael Antonio Aguilar. Rebeca Vanessa. Rebeca Vanessa. Sandra Guadalupe. Present, Miss. Thank you so much. Sandra Margarita. Present. Thank you. Sochil Yamilet. Present. Thank you. Judy Edith. Present. Thank you so much, guys. Let's go ahead. Okay, we got this practice already, some questions. Now we are going to continue on this part. We are going to check about different activities. So remember that in the different activities, we have like a do exercise, we have a sports, right? We have actions that you do in your routine. So like a drive, play tennis, all of those. For that, we are going to watch that video on our platform. <laughs> so remember that you have the exercise on the platform. Then we go ahead with the video. Mike is playing. Everything okay? With the video? Okay. Could you hear it? Yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll become familiar with vocabulary in order to express activities. Let's start by listening and repeating. He's playing tennis. He's riding a bike. She's running. He's swimming. She's taking a walk. They're dancing. She's driving. They're going to the movies. He's shopping. She's reading. She's studying. He's watching television. Now, your task is to describe the actions from the pictures and form statements in the present continuous. For example, he's playing tennis. She is riding a bike. You should get creative and change the he or she for names of people that you know. For example, Mike is playing tennis. Mary is uh, riding a bike. 
After you complete this exercise, please share your work in our discussion forums. Okay, we have the different actions. Now you are going to give me more examples, but I have the first one, for example, here. That we say, he's running, right? You have the base form of the verb or the original form of the verb. But remember that in present continuous, you need to write or mention the base form of the verb and you include ing. Now, he's running. What about the first one that you have? In the case of play tennis, start. Nevi, give us an example, please. Another example. Puede ser con, con otro, mis, o, o siempre ah, con yes. mi. Select the other one that you want. It can be play tennis, it can be take, but depending on the picture. Depends on the picture. If it's he, she, they. Uh -huh. eh, they are, they are they uh, swimming. They are swimming. 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 Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, no, because look, depending on the picture. In the case of swimming, you only have one person. Right? So the subject he. is only one. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Correct. Uh -huh. he. Ah, that's good. Okay, complete, please. He's? He's swimming. He's swimming. Uh -huh. What happens with the M? Because double. we have double, right? We have double, consonant. Double M. Excellent. Double M, I, N, G. And the I, N, G. Perfect. That's good. M, I, N, G. That's very good. Swimming. He's swimming. Excellent. Continue, Judy. Select yeah. another one. Select a different my, activity. My son. Okay. My son is riding a bike. Is riding? Riding, riding a, a bike. A bike. Excellent. Thank you. That's good. Kenya and Vanessa, continue. She, she is mm -hmm. dancing. Is, is it she? Okay, try to do it because it's plural subject. Hey, the they, subject is they. they are. Ah, very good. They are. They are dancing. Ah. Are dancing. They are dancing because now it's plural. It's they, ellos, right? Mm -hmm. Look at the picture. It's depending on the picture, yes? They are dancing. Now give me a compliment. Dancing in the house, dancing at the disco, in dancing the at the party. At the where? party. In the party, excellent. In That's the party. Good. They are dancing in the party. Very good job. That's nice. Continue, Fernando. Fernando, are you present? My my friend is driving his car. All right, but look at that here. The case is a woman, right? So is he or she? She. She, right? Uh huh. Because it's a woman, it's a girl. So is she is driving. Uh huh. Driving. In the car. A car. A car. A car. A car. She is driving a car. Good one. No se puede decir como él dijo, Miss, que dijo my friend, mi amiga. But yeah, sure, you can say it. Just that I heard he said my son. Solo que escuché que dijo eh, mi hijo. No, my friend dijo. My friend. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. I heard my son. I'm sorry. Yeah, that was okay. Yes, you can say. My friend. Escuché que dijo my son. My friend is driving a car. Yes. En friends, le falta la de. Oh, yes. Ay, this, this type, yes. Thank you. That is good. Thank you. My friend Miss is driving la, a car. Miss, en la que yo le dije, my son is uh, reading, writing. Is writing. Time. Is missing the action. Yes, thank you. Yes. Writing. Thank you. <laughs> writing about oh now you analyze very good job that's great it's cool excellent okay yeah. what is another one sandra guadalupe 
Continue, please. Another example. Mm. Select another they, activity. Uh huh. They, we are go to the movies. What is the action? Remember, it's present continuous. It's occurring at this moment. So, what is the form of the uh, verb? Going. We uh -huh. are going to are the movies. Ah, going. That's good. We are going. We are going to the movies. To the movies. What movies do we have here? In the case of, for example, Cinemark, right? Cinepolis. Cinepolis. Cinepolis, right? Uh huh. Yeah. Cinepolis. Cinepolis, uh -huh. okay, so we are going to the movie. In my television, in my house. Oh, yeah, it's better. It's, más cómodo. it's more comfortable, actually, yes. I prefer, I prefer to watch a movie in my house. Netflix. Prefer, because it's more comfortable, it's más cómodo. Unless that there is a movie that I really like. A menos que sea una película que en realidad sí llama la atención. Right? Really good. But imagine to watch Barbie. Barbie. <laughs> I'm sorry? Are you going to watch Barbie? Did you no. watch Barbie? Yes. No. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. <laughs> okay, let's continue then. Aaron, give us another example. Uh, he he's dancing okay but this one are depending on the subject you have two subjects here he's dancing uh, reggaeton and they are dancing because it's two persons, yes? They are dancing. Reggaeton. Reggaeton or perreo? Oh, they. Son, son dos. Ajá, because these they, are two they are dancing. Uh, reggaeton and perreo. Okay. It's a mix. Is that a mix? It is the same. It's the same. Reggaeton and Perreo is the same. Is it the same? Yes. Okay. The rhythm is the same, right? El ritmo no, it's the same. same. It's the same. Is, is, is it the same? same? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> ya se emocionó, niña. Ya yeah, she's excited. <laughs> now. I know. I know. It's the same. El viernes y el cuerpo lo sabe, va. The, the body knows that. Oye, bicho, yo ya cambié. Mira, el viernes y yo aquí en casa, con clase. At home. You're at home. At home. Yes. Teacher, I, I have that. Yes, Ada, tell me. Tell me. Um, my grandmother talking. Is a talking. Walk, talking. A oh, walk talking is this. Look, talking no, is taking, platicando. Taking, taking, taking. Ah, that's good. My, my grandmother taking uh -huh. a is, walk. Is taking a walk. In the street. No, that's good. In the street. Teacher. Yes, tell me. Eh, podría decirse, she is reading a book in the park. That is correct, yes. She is reading. Repeat it, please. She is. She is reading, reading. Uh -huh. a book a in book? the park. A book in the park. Yes, that is correct. It's perfect. A book in the park. Excellent. Excellent, Excellent right. company. It's really good. Yes, nice one. What about Rafael? Rafael, are you present? Teacher. Hello. En el en la celebración no salió. Le pones tu nombre. Me quedó la duda dónde era. Typing, typing, no sé cómo se llama. Oh, ¿Cómo se dice? typing. It appears the sound. ¿Escucharon los sonidos que les envié? Se los envié en el grupo. Sí. sí. Typing. Sí, typing es, is this. Actually, 
Yes, no, I have no. a picture here. I prepared a picture by here. This one. This one is typing. Look. This is typing. Typing, it comes from type, que proviene del verbo eh, digitar. So let me check. Let me write here. This one is type. Type es el verbo. Esa es la forma base del verbo. This typing, that will be like this, typing, digitando. So you type on the keyboard, en el teclado, right? You type. You type on a calculator. You type on the keyboard or the cell phone. Yes, so that is type. Digitar. Teacher, Abby tiene una pregunta. Yes. Tell me, Abby. No, mentira. En no <laughs> Ah, that's right. Ada, what happens, Ada? Ada, is the one who wants to ask. Ada, you have a question, Ada? No, I saw it standing up. Ah, okay. No, it wasn't us. It was 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 us. Ah, sorry, teacher, sorry. I misinterpreted. Okay. Any question? Entonces ese término sería como, como este digital. Cuando se está tecleando el, 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 el en la computadora. Ajá. Digitando. Ajá. It can be on the on a computer, it can be on a contometer, on a calculator. Yes. So you can use it. Porque en el sonido era máquina de escribir, mis. Exactly. Ajá. So they're Correcto. using like that. Que tenía su sonido y todo. So that's correct. It was type. Una caja exactly. Uh -huh. That they have a sound too. So, siempre cuando lleva un teclado, that is possible to type. Okay. Yes. Any other question? Who has more questions? No? No. Other question? No, teacher, thank you. No? Okay, thank you. Now, we have other activities here. Let's answer here. What is she doing? What's the answer? She's driving. She's driving. Driving. She's driving. 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 driving what? A car. A car. A car. A car. A car. Yes. A car. That's all right. She's driving red. a car. Red car. A red car. A red car? Is that yes. a red car? No, 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 no. no. A beige. A beige car. Uh -huh. Internally, right? It's beige. Okay. What about this one? What is he doing? He's he uh, swimming. swimming. Ah, he's swimming. In the pool. In the pool, excellent. He is swimming in the pool. He's swimming in the pool. Yes, that's correct. Good one. What about the little girl? What is she doing? She is eating. She is eating. She is eating. Ah, that's good. She is eating vegetables. Vegetables. Hey, sometimes they don't like vegetables, right? A veces no les gustan. They don't like vegetables. What about what is she doing? She is a computer. But the action? She is watching a movie. Ah, possibly. Mm -hmm. Remember that on a computer it's possible like to watch a video. Uh, receive a class, yes. Some of you, you are receiving a class on a laptop or on a desktop computer, right? Working also is possible to do it. Suppose that she's watching a video. She is watching a video oh, on YouTube. Uh -huh. What else? She's uh, typing... Mm. Uh, She's laptop. typing on, uh -huh, on the laptop. On the laptop. That's good. She is typing 
on the laptop. Yeah, that's correct because it's, she's typing, right? She's watching a video, she's watching a movie, she's watching a series, a program, a music video. So you have different possibilities here. Recibiendo, receiving. Receiving. Aha, uh -huh. she's receiving a, a video class. Call, no sé, ah, idea. that's good. She's receiving a video call. Yes, that's correct. Así se dice, teacher. Yeah, call. receiving, porque la está recibiendo. But now, if you say, está haciendo una llamada, entonces she's, she's making, she's making a video call. That's another possibility. Like this. She's, she's making, making a video call. Mm -hmm. That is correct. A video call. Okay, but we'll continue practicing this. Questions? ¿Por qué en algunos momentos se hace contractada la respuesta y en otros no? Porque ahí tenemos en esas, mm -hmm. en esas tres que aparecen ahí abajo, cheese mm -hmm. y she is. Mm -hmm. Because it, it's contraction. Contractor. Another uh -huh. one is complete, but what happened is that you have two manners. Las dos formas son correctas. Esta es contractada y esta es completa, pero ambas son correctas. Es para que vean que las dos posibilidades. Para, so para hay dos maneras. La conversación puede ser la contractada. In which one? Sorry. Para entablar una conversación más fluida, exactly. podría ser contractada. Ajá, uh -huh. exacto. Es como para hacerla más práctica. La conversación, para hacerla más práctica, más fluida y de dos palabras hace uno y es correcto, no es informal es correcto thank you miss my pleasure any other question no more questions no miss All right, we'll continue on Monday then remember that we need to like uh, reprogram the classes. See you Monday, teacher. See you Monday. Yes. Sí. Porque nos van a reprogramar esa clase, ¿verdad? Que no tuvimos, entonces se va a reprogramar, pero siempre nos van a confirmar por medio del grupo. En ese momento no tenemos no, nada para el lunes, para la luna, ¿verdad, Miss? No, because this one, well, actually, this Terminamos one was con... only is missing one. Examen, ¿verdad? The exam, ajá, trate de terminar el examen, como ya vieron, esta última es el present progressive, lo único que nos queda pendiente acá es seguir haciendo práctica de esto mismo, y quedaba pendiente. Me, eh, una pregunta, y digamos, ya cuando ya terminemos, ellos nos van a mandar las notas. Sí, exacto, ajá, al terminar, porque tiene que terminarse todas las sesiones. Okay. Y ahí ellos ya les comunican a ustedes. El ajá, examen eso, es lo último. ¿verdad? El examen, ajá, exacto. Sí, así ellos son los, los que, que nos van a confirmar. Ya estamos libres de todo eso. Ya están libres de toda la evaluación. Sí, sí ya lo finalizaron. A esperar que aperturen el segundo módulo, Miss. Ajá, y a terminar la última sesión también, que también pues Porque ellos la tienen competencia. que tomar en cuenta, ¿verdad? Por la asistencia y todo eso, y ahí pues que nos confirman cuál sería la fecha, si va a ser pues consecutivo el, el segundo módulo o, o cómo es que lo van a organizar ellos. O sea que ahorita o... nos falta una clase. ¿no? Sí, solo nos falta una, porque por esa que la no tuvimos. Fin. Ajá, por esa que no tuvimos. La del día de la tormenta. Ah, Exacto. Y, y, que no se pudo nos dio la clase la Miss Ada. Ajá, yes, teacher Ada was assisting you. O no sea, la que el trabajo no contó. Después de lunes a esperar el segundo módulo. Ellos ajá, nos van a confirmar. Pero ellos sí nos van a, no, ajá, ellos nos van a confirmar. No, sí. Ajá, ajá. Ellos sí nos van a confirmar eso. Porque de hecho, fíjese que no estoy segura si van a ser dos clases que se van a reponer, porque hubo una en que hubo un problema técnico y no se logró grabar completa la clase. Pero nos van a confirmar, ¿verdad? Ahí son. Pues la vez que yo estuve pasando la lista, ¿se acuerdan? 
<risa> ajá, ah, that it was a problem. Ajá, que hubo un problema ahí con la plataforma, entonces sí no se grabó todo el video. Pero ellos son los que nos van a confirmar, ¿verdad? Vaya, teacher. Uh -huh. So we you. have only pending. Thank you. So this on the platform, Good right? This exercise on the platform and this one to practice. Nos falta esto de, de practicar. ¿Qué es de los temas que ya vimos? Uh -huh. Yes. 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 All right, guys. Yes. Happy weekend. Happy Enjoy week. it. Relax. Thank you so much. Have a nice weekend. And blessings. Bendiciones. Blessings for everybody. Bye, Goodbye. Happy weekend. See you on Monday. Goodbye. See you. Good night. Have a good night.